In this video, we'll balance redox reactions. So our first problem here in 18.2 part A is Mn plus 2 going to MnO2, hydrogen peroxide H2O2 going to H2O water. And this is happening in basic solution. So in basic solution, we have a lot of OH minus around. And then we also have a lot of H2O around. So we have Mn plus 2 going to uh, MnO2 minus MnO2. And this is actually in basic solution, looking back at this problem here. Uh, we balance the MNs already. I'm going to balance the oxygens with water. And then I'm going to ba balance the hydrogens with H+. Plus, realizing I cannot have H+, plus because this is in uh, base, not acid. So I will neutralize the corresponding H+, plus with four OH minuses. And whatever OH minuses I add, to one side, I have to add the equivalent amount to the other side. And then we can go ahead and balance the charges here. Uh, minus 4 plus 2 is um, minus 2. So I have a minus 2 on one side. So I will put a 2 electrons to get a minus 2 on the other side. Now 4H plus plus 4OH minus is 4H2O. So um, out of these 4H2Os, two of them cancel out with the two H2Os here, leaving me with two waters. So let's go ahead and write out this redox reaction. This is oxidation. Okay, anytime you lose electrons or they're on the product side, that's oxidation. Half reaction, which is going to be probably has to be this one because for every oxidation, there is a reduction. So H2O2 going to water. So let's go ahead and balance uh, this out here. So I have two oxygens here. I have one oxygen here, so I'll put a two here. This, this gives me four hydrogens. I'm not going to add a two here because then it will just be a back and forth. The way it, what I will do is I will balance out the hydrogens with H plus. So two hydrogens plus two hydrogen is four. Two times two is four. Realizing I'm in base, so I got to add an equivalent amount of hydroxide ion, and I'm going to add the hydroxide ion here. And now we can go ahead and balance the charge. So um, minus two plus two is zero. Here I have minus two here, so I'm going to add two e minus here to balance out the charge of the minus two from the hydroxide ion. So minus 2, this is just water, neutralizing the H plus with the base because I have a lot of base around. So uh, this is two waters. The two waters actually cancel out with the two waters over here, leaving me with 2E minus plus H2O2. And that's going to go to 2 hydroxide ion. And then um, let's rewrite this. Uh, well, let's just uh, add them up now okay, instead of rewriting everything. Um, so the 2E minus and 2E minus cancel. Uh, the 4OH minus, two of them will cancel out with two of these, leaving me with 2OH minus here. And um, I think we have everything that we need to balance this equation. So it's going to be MN plus 2 plus 2OH minus plus H2O2. And that's going to go to MnO2 plus 2H2O. Right, remembering now that these, these two OH minuses cancel out with those four OH minusing, minuses, leaving us with uh, no OH minuses in the product side. So MN1, MN1 balanced. Uh, two oxygens plus two oxygens is four oxygens. Two oxygens plus two oxygens is four oxygens. Uh, two hydrogens plus two hydrogens is four hydrogens. 2 times 2 is 4 hydrogens here. Uh, here's the charge now. Um, minus 2, 2OH two two OH minus is minus 2, plus 2 is 0, and we have a 0 here. So this is our balanced chemical equation uh, in basic solution.